Welcome to It's Fun and Games. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Today's video, it like, how long ago is it? 2023? Like, almost a month ago now? It's 2023? So, we're gonna show us my top 10 cards in my hockey card collection. So, and I'm here with Daddy, so. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, so we're gonna look at our top 10. So, let's just get right into it. Number 10 is this Leon Dreisaitl Rookie Inaugural Materials Overtime Graded 8 Jersey Rookie yes, it's from SPX. I think I bought that card a while ago. It's worth $60. Isn't bad. Nope, that's a dandy card. I like that Dreisaitl. Yeah, it's nice. I'll put them back here for you. Yeah. There you go. Number 9 the my Reed Duke Future Watch Patch Auto three color patch auto fifty of a hundred. Nice. That's like one of my favorite cards. That's nice. That's number nine. That's worth about sixty. Here is my bought this at a show. First show we ever went to. My Quinn Hughes PSA nine. Love that card. It's my first big card. Or my second big card, actually. That was your first big show purchase, though, wasn't it? That yeah. was your first purchase at that a show? That one's worth about 70 that one. This was my first big purchase. Yeah, I like this card real well. Yeah, this That's is it. my Jake Gensel Day with the Cup Auto. Love that card. Bought that. Oh, a while ago now. Almost when we first started collecting. This one's worth... About 80, and it's like almost like it was painted on there. It's cool, eh? Yeah, that's a great card. That's a almost like a photograph, but not really like a caricature. Yeah. And then it's got the blue auto. I love that one. Didn't think this card would have made my... It's not going to stay there, but we'll set it down that way. Didn't think this, this card would have made my top 10, but he shot up. Jason Robertson, Young Gun. He has shot up. This is worth about 80 bucks now. When we first started pulling him, I think we could, he was like a 10 or $15 card. And yeah. then we kept a few of them. We sold a few of them. And then he just started to really perform and shoot way up. So Yeah, so I didn't think that would make my top 10, but it did. It's we worth about 80 now. Should have sent him to grading when we sent some stuff. but This is another big show purchased. Same show, my Brady Kachuk PSA 9. It's worth about... What was that worth? 80? Yeah, that's the yeah, 80. Yeah, that's the 80. It was 100 for a long time. It was 100, time, but, but... Lately, he's dropped down a little tiny bit. Yeah, which isn't bad. That's a nice card. Nope, nice card. Pretty sure you still picked it up for way less than that. Yeah, and this is where they start to get bigger. This is the top four. Here we go. Number four is the Elias Pedersen 9-5, BGS 9-5. Almost straight 9-5. Only centering got a 9. Love that card. I picked that up for 130 And now it's worth like 140 So not a whole much of a difference. But it's a nice card to have. I've been wanting one for a while. It's not bad, eh? That's a beauty. Yep, we got that on uh, SFTB, I think. Then graded this one ourself. The Adam, or my Adam Fox in a... On Beginner Breaks, our breaking channel, we pulled this card, and then I graded it. So, this is the Adam Fox Overtime Grading 9.5. That's worth about, like, 150, 160, which isn't bad. Love that card there. This is the most recent show pickup. My, this is number two, my Mitch Marner Raw Young Gun. That is a beauty. It's 200. I'm surprised Raw is going for that much, but that's nice. And that card is sharp. That's easy. A nine, it prop, maybe even a 10, depending on what, but uh, there's no way that grades less than a nine. That's a beauty. Yeah, it's a nice card. Love that. Number two. And my number one card. Thought my Marner would beat it, but it didn't. My Jack Hughes Overtime 9. I did not think this would be number one. 
That's the most valuable card in your collection? Yeah. Yeah. I did not think so, but he's shot up. Apparently, I bought this for $80 back a while ago. Now it's worth $220. There you go. Nice Holy. pickup from 80 to 220 I thought my Marner would be my number one, so but I, yeah, not bad. Sure. So that is my top 10 cards so far We're so still far still working still breaking so i hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching hope you like this video